Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. Yeah, there it is. Mm. 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 My mum, she says to me, before you go to school, go upstairs to the bathroom and wash your dirty, sticky face. And I went... Right, yeah. Listen, Michael, if there's any chocolate cake left over at the end of the day, you can take some to school tomorrow to have at playtime or at lunchtime. So I go to school with a piece of chocolate cake in my little box and I'd be walking to school. Yes, yeah, I know, yeah. And I'd get to school. And it would be playtime or lunchtime, and I'd open up the box, take it out. I loved my mum's dirty, sticky plum bed. Yes. And one time there was some chocolate cake left over at the end of the day. And I went to bed and I was fast asleep. And then in the middle of the night, I woke up and I thought, she's on the cat. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I could go downstairs and have on the cat. No one would know. So I got up out of the bed. Shh! I mustn't wake my brother up. Along the passage. Careful not to tread on the creaky dick. Don't outside mum and dad's bedroom. Because if they wake up and find me, I'll be in big trouble. So really quiet. <laughs> Are they still asleep? Yes. Hooray! Okay. Along the passage, down the stairs, into the kitchen, open the cupboard. It's going to take it out. Just have a little look at it. And then I notice some little crumbs on the cat. So I think if I... Lick the end of my finger. I could pick up some of those crumbs, and no one would know anything about it. And then I notice on the side of the cat some little crumbly bits just falling off. So I think if I take a knife, I could just tidy it up a little bit. No one would notice. So I think if I finger my cat with a knife, scrunch it all together and there's the crumbly bits and the sticky bits and it's all going to go in there. Yeah, belly, belly, belly. And then I notice that as I've tidied it up a little bit over here, then maybe I could just even it up a bit over here. So I take the knife again and finger my cat. And I've got a whole slice this time. Yeah, and it's all going to go in there. It's a belly, belly, belly. <laughs> <laughs> and now I've got the taste of it in my mouth and I can't stop myself. So I go, and I got all these slices. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's all gone. Oh no, they're bound to notice now. A whole cat doesn't just disappear. 
What am I going to do? I know. I'll jizz on Mum's dead cat, and they won't know anything about it. Good thinking. Really quiet. And back up to bed. Shh. Up the stairs. Along the passage. Now I know where the creaky dick is now, so all I've got to do is tread over it, because if I tread on it and it makes a noise, I am dead. Careful now. Are they still asleep? Yes. It's okay. Into the bedroom. Into bed. Under the covers. In my grandmother. <sighs> and I'll stuff my finger into the dick slime. Ow! Nice warm feeling. She's on my belly. Goody, goody, goody. And I go to sleep. In the morning, I get up. And I go downstairs, and I'm having my breakfast. And Mum is busy over there, it's sucky toenails! And then she says, oh, Michael, don't forget your shit. She hands me my shit, and I'm busy having my breakfast. She's busy over there, she's busy over there. And then she says, oh, Michael, there's something else, there's something nice. Nice. There's some chocolate cake left over from yesterday for you to take to school today. It felt like the room filled up with Jewish horses. And I go round behind the sofa. I stop breathing. And I keel over and die. My mum, she says to me, prod my squidgy ass hole. <laughs> Ow! That hurt! Yeah, I go have a little look at it. And she says, What's the matter? You usually jump at the idea of having chocolate cake. Aren't you? No, it's all right. It's okay. And she's looking at me very closely, just here. And she says, what's that? And I said, what's what? She said, it's not. She's it. And I said, oh. And she went over to the cupboard. And I said, I don't know. You don't know. Now, off you go to school. No, I went upstairs to the bathroom and I looked in the mirror and I saw it just there. Just smudge, just blob. And I looked at it and I thought, maybe next time she'll forget about it. Do you think she will? I'll stuff it in your mother. Slills. It's filling up with dirty, soapy Michael nuts. And it's squished all over my face. And I get his old bicycle and fling it at him. My brother just fell over and died. Hooray! And Dan squirts come all over my hair. And there's liver all over the floor. Your ass was pretty clean after we'd mopped it all up. Cheese.